Doesn't stretching daily really make us grow taller? Well, I'm going to prove you that it is possible. Do you want to try a game with me? Let's do it. So place your hands right here in front of you. Grab one hand, just choose one and stretch it as much as possible. Really without moving, stretch it, stretch it, stretch it, stretch it more, stretch it more. Elongate it, elongate it, elongate it. More, 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 more. <gasps> Look at this, it's longer. Do you want to know my three favorite exercises to grow taller? Let's not delay then, let's practice. The very first thing that we think about when we want to grow taller is how do we do this? <gasps> This is the first thing that you do, elongating the spine, elongating your neck from the ears and your head. The very first thing that we need to work on is our back, because if we're shrinking down and we are, we are slouching, our back suffers and we are not that tall, are we? So let's think about our posture and this exercise will help you definitely grow the spine and elongating the spine vertebra by vertebra. So the very first exercise I want you to think about is to wrap around your hands right behind and pushing the chest towards the ceiling. Opening up and really counting balance what we've been working on for so long throughout the day. This will help you out opening up the front of the chest, the front of the diaphragm. It will help you also breathe better. Elongating the upper back and yes, growing boobs no it won't but it will it will help you sustain those muscles this exercise can be done every single day whether you're sitting or standing i highly recommend do it standing up also because in a way it gets you to work your lower abdominals your glutes and your inside thighs because if done properly oh yes it can shape up a lot more muscles than you think Exercise number two has got a beautiful way of elongating the sides, the quads, the underarms and neck. Again, it can be done every single day, whether you're sitting down, I give you the two versions, or standing up. I always highly recommend to do this exercise standing up because yes, it does work more muscles. That's why I love about ballet. We're standing, we're stretching, we're elongating. And plus, bonus, this will also help you out opening your hips and opening your hips and feeling a little bit more free in your walk, in your feeling elegant and your feeling free and especially without back pain isn't it amazing I love this one so by stretching side to side elongating and helping yourself with breathing really find the calm breathing I know that sometimes these stretches can hurt a little bit but as every woman told me in my life no pain no gain the good pain though so by stretching really elongating and opening it up it will also get rid of the little muffin tops that we find on top of jeans every now and then i love bali for this it elongates it strengthens you up it stretches and also makes you feel fantastic and about feeling fantastic we figure now that stretching has got a lot more benefits that we think of so today I'm inviting you also to a beautiful event that I'm going to be doing in April where we're going to be stretching we're going to be elongating we're gonna find our femininity through stretching because I know that opening up hips finding splits finding the elongation Finding the extension of our beautiful legs and body will make you feel more confident and more feminine and like a woman because we like to be in charge of our body. So if you want to know more, click on the link down in the description box below to register for the three day splits and flexibility workshop live online with me. Exercise number three is going to make you feel like a true ballerina. It is a movement into stretch. I love this kind of exercises because active stretching and stretching with movement will make those muscles grow 
longer and leaner and is going to add up those extra few inches to our height. So this exercise is start in a lounge with two feet under or one in the front, one at the back. And we go from forward to back, really picking up a bunch of flowers, taking up to the top and stretching and reaching down the back. I know, be really careful that you don't let go of your abs because that is going to strain on the back. And we don't want the vertebrae to be squished. We want the vertebrae to be elongated. This is how we get those extra inches, guys. So from here, really stretch all the way up and all the way back like there is a drop of water coming down onto your neck. And then from here, feel the stretch through the psoas muscles, the quad and the calf as well because remember it's not just about elongating from our back is also how much we elongate our legs and even if they are on the ground the feeling and the stretch is still happening adding these three simple exercises every single day to your routine to your daily routine i'm not talking about workout routine i'm talking about daily routine i promise you you will get those two three inches extra on your height because your body will feel so much freer your vertebrae will elongate your legs will elongate and your muscles will be engaged in order for sustaining the whole body every single time that you walk or sit and this is how we get our femininity and beautiful posture back so start by standing tall add these three exercises to your routine every single day and let's grow taller and if you want to add some extra stretches to your routine today I think this is a very good stretch that will help you elongate even more your body do it right now it's nice and easy and it's fun